You know I'm different from them. I'm from a different club. I got a Nina Ross. Ninth grade, getting paid. Sunshine, no shade. All day, every day. Southwest Atlanta, A. Okay. Let me start, nigga. Today's review comes courtesy of West Kiss. If you are not familiar, I have done a few reviews for this company. Um, my last one being a tutorial on how I achieved this beautiful, almost auburn, golden brown. I don't know really what you would call this. Like a beautiful brunette color. Um, and that was maybe about a week or two. I will have that video linked down below. But I don't know. I was kind of in the mood for something a little bit shorter. And I decided I wanted to take my brunette hair from about 20 inches long to about 10 to 12 inches long basically shoulder length this hair is their Peruvian body wave hair I think it'll look really really cute if I just wet it down and kind of wore it messy to be exact um, the lengths were 18 and 222's and then the frontal was a 16 inch lace frontal so if you're interested in seeing how I take it from 22 inches to about 10 inches stay tuned <laughs> So basically I was going for like a choppy bob. I didn't want it to be perfect to be honest. I don't even know if I can cut the hair perfect, but let me show you guys what the hair looks like from the back. If it's a little bit too uneven, I'll definitely go back and clean it up off camera. But you guys pretty much get the picture. I'm just going to go around and bump it. This hair is Peruvian Body Wave. Um, I've done a review on the hair and I actually did a tutorial on how I achieved this color from a natural brown color. Um, the lengths were 18, 20, and 20. Um, three bundles, yeah, 18, 20, 20, and then the lace frontal was 16 inches. Obviously, it's probably about between 10 and 12 inches now that I've cut it. But this is exactly like in the front, this is what I was looking for. Um, like I said, I'll go back and clean it up. I just find it difficult to clean up um, or cut hair perfectly with scissors. 
I think it's so much easier when you do it with a um, pair of clippers. But my kids are sleeping right now, so I don't want to use the clippers and wake them up. So just go around and lightly bump it. I think this would look so much better if I went back to dark roots. So maybe I'll show you guys how I do that. I like showing you guys when I do things step by step, just so you guys can see. I'm definitely not a professional at this, so whatever you see is, you know, pretty much me learning it from the ground up. But I don't have any, um, like, cosmetology experience for real, so whatever you see is what you get. I felt like before the hair was very natural as far as the fullness. And because I went ahead and cut it, now it just feels so much more heavier here. So that's something that I do have to learn is how to um, how to thin out here so that it doesn't feel so dense, I guess you would say. Bless you, Dakota. But I absolutely love it. I think it looks good on me. Let me know what you guys think. I'm just taking my flat iron and kind of going across the parting and this flat iron this is the babyless pro um, prima 3000 you see these two burns here I turned it off and then something fell on top of it I went to grab it and I like hit myself with it mind you it had been off for a few minutes and it's still burning really bad so it goes up to 465 degrees and it literally gets super hot so if you're looking for something to um, like tame your natural hair, that I highly, highly, highly recommend. But like I said, it gets really, really hot, so you want to be careful not to um, burn yourself like I did. But yeah, this was just a quick tutorial showing you guys how I was going to cut the hair. Like I said, I do want to go back in, and I'm thinking about either dyeing the roots back dark so that it's more brown girl friendly or maybe I will add some highlights let me know in the comments which you guys would like to see next but I think this will do for now I really really do love it again let me know what you guys want to see next with this hair either highlights or um, dark a tutorial on how to darken the roots um, leave it in the comments below and I will go with whatever you guys choose. And don't forget to check the description bar on a link to where to purchase this hair. And also I will have the videos that I've done previously for this hair as far as how I got the color and the initial review on this hair from Wet Kiss. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Oh, 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 oh,